Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel, Miss Nobuntu, uh, where you will be seeing singing, clothing, and me talking. Today I'm actually here to talk about what I just experienced in the, in the past two days or between yesterday and today. On my computer, I had a lot of windows opened and it got to the point where there were certain sites that I couldn't get into that I was previously getting into easily on any other day. Um, and the whole of yesterday I experienced this problem. I was trying to get onto Facebook, I was trying to get onto other websites that I would usually go into and I just couldn't get in. And then today um, I had this light bulb moment. God tells me, declutter your open windows. So close all the windows that you have open on your browser that you were like scared to let go of because there is something that is of value to you, that's important to you, that's making you keep those windows open, but just close them because you don't need them right now. And I was like, but does that information is like, then you can go to your history and retrieve that page. So I decided, I closed a number of pages, you know, and it was a significant number. And then I, I typed in the very same websites that I had spent all of yesterday trying to get into and couldn't get into at all. Uh, and this time around, I was able to get in like, like that. And it's funny because the computer kept on saying clear cash, but I'm like, what does that mean? What does that mean? Now you out there and you're thinking, how come she doesn't mean, she doesn't know what it means to clear cash. I didn't know. Okay. So, um, so when I realized that clearing the cash is closing the windows, right? So I went to this very same website that I'd been trying to get into yesterday and voila, I could go in. But what happened is that while I couldn't get into those websites, I became kind of resourceful and used other websites to do the very same things that I wanted to do um, on those platforms where I would usually do them. I used other platforms. And, but then when I could get back, then I could get back. But from all of this, I just learned that, you know, declutter, clear your cash in your life, in your home, and that allows for flow. Uh, if there's a sense of uh, a lack of flow, a sense of constipation that you feel in an area in your life, consider decluttering. You might have too much stuff that you've started and you haven't completed. You might have too much stuff in your cupboard. Uh, you might have too much stuff um, open on your computer. You might just have too much stuff cluttering around, not serving any purpose, and it is blocking um, any other new thing from coming in or blocking, blocking you from seeing the things that could work because there's so much clutter. You're not able to discern the gems amongst the clutter. So that's what I learned from that, that, you know, just declutter. Clear your cash as a human being. It might need. It might mean friends for some people. You might have too many friends, and that's why you're not getting value from your friendships. You might have too many shoes, too much, too much clothing. That's why you have a cupboard full of, a closet full of clothing, but you don't know what to wear every day, and we're looking at you like. You have an entire room for clothes, and you don't know what to wear. You know. Uh, Stuff inhibits and hinders, stuff hinders flow, whether it's emotional stuff, whether it's spiritual stuff, whether it's physical stuff. It hinders flow of what is new and what is bringing new life and what is bringing new possibilities and, and, con and uh, perpetuates a continuum of infinite possibilities in your life. Stuff hinders that. So you constantly have to take inventory and clear your cash and clear up your space and, and, and throw things away and give things away and, and, and limit the things that you have. 
not as a matter of minimalism oh i mean minimalist but as a matter of this is how flow inflow of things keeps going into my life and that even means giving money sometimes you might have to give away money you you might be this kind of person who's earning a lot of money but you're not giving any of it away and there's just so much of it in your hands in your bank account in all your storehouses but because you share it with no one it's kind of hindering the flow of more coming in give some away find someone to help find a cause to put money into and send them money and that will continue that will open up space for flow into your life so that's all i came here to say today i hope you're doing well it's still hot but I'm just loving this chestnut. Can't nobody. Can't nobody. So <laughs> I will see you next time. I'm going to come back on here and begin to sing for you. Um, looking for bookings and I'm looking to uh, get back into singing again. So I'm going to come back and sing. So watch this space. Another thing coming down my sleeve. Um, yeah. All I ask for is your support beforehand. Your likes are cool, your shares are cool, your compliments are cool. I'm looking for your buy-in, so um, yeah. Anything that I put out there, I'm looking for your buy-in. That's for me, the thing that's going to move me from here to the next level. So thank you for watching. I dig you. I love you. That's why I, doing, I keep doing this. And um, yeah, see you next time. Stay blessed and be blessed.